Alright guys, this is the first meal of the day. We went to work out. I fasted in the morning, so it's already 3.30 in the afternoon, California time. And the first meal, like you guys know, I made a, cre I made a TikTok about this. This is a smoothie, alright? It's a peanut butter oatmeal protein, whatever the fuck smoothie. First thing you need, well you don't need this, but my brother copped this, so I was like, fuck it. But it's protein powder, all right? Use a little bit of protein powder. Second step, it's a banana or two. It don't matter, you can use fucking strawberry, banana, fucking blueberries, whatever type of fruit you like, use that shit. I like banana, I put one banana. Protein powder, banana, five, six, seven, eight, 10, 11, 12 scoops of oatmeal. Old fashioned oatmeal, remember that guys? You don't wanna use that artificial shit. Make sure it's old fashioned oatmeal, all right? Just do hell scoops, that's what I do. I don't even fucking count that shit. As you can tell, look at that shit. That's hell of fucking scoops. Peanut butter, that's gonna be the next step peanut butter doesn't matter what type of peanut butter and then finally so it can be liquefied you can do water almond milk milk mommy milk Dimitri school milk it don't matter what type of milk use the fucking milk all right that's it just fucking <coughs> ingest that shit all the way make sure you put more milk all right now we just need to blend that shit this is about 500 to a thousand calories depending on how much old-fashioned oatmeal you oatmeal you put in it yeah this is a really good meal but make sure you don't work out 30 minutes before because this shit takes a fucking while to digest so now we just gotta fucking blend this shit all right check out the magic now it's time to freaking drink it what you looking at all right, guys, it's gonna be the second meal of the day. 428 to be exact. We're gonna make a burrito, all right? Last time I did make a, a burrito for the TikTok, but this one's a little bit different. Instead of using eggs, it's gonna be some pig and some steak. And if you wanna use the little tortilla, you can. You can use whatever type of tortilla, it don't really matter. Tortilla, tortilla, say it right, guys, tortilla. Tortilla. And for the protein, you can use eggs, steak, pig, doesn't matter, as long as you get your protein intake in. Just to make it a little bit Better, we're gonna put some onion. That's cilantro, all right? Usually we use this for the tacos, but kind of like putting this in the burrito, no cap. A little bit of pepper jack cheese. Tell them, tell them hook. For all y'all that are lactose intolerant, don't put this in, all right? We just wanna feed the gains, you see that? Making all kinds of gains, you know what I'm saying? Bruh, the water. You gotta drink a whole mug of water thing. A lot of y'all like drinking the soda pop. Put some love juice in your body. And don't don't get me wrong, I like soda pop too. La Huita Bendita. Nice and fresh. This is what gets the organs nice and tight. Put some love juice in your body. <laughs> Crispy. We use our fingers to mix it up, guys. We don't care, guys. This, this is how you know you're Mexican. Your fingers are immune to getting burned. Look, you got half of you guys can't even do that. Cause your hands are not strong enough. Open up the cheese, man. If you guys want to know a little tip, if you don't want to melt the cheese on the pan, this is what you're gonna do. Broke, breaking, broken up, breaking up. Yeah, we're gonna use two. I love cheese. Some rat vibes right there. I remember I used to watch Tom and Jerry while I used to eat cheese. No cap, I remember I used to do that in T-Town. If you know T-Town, you're a real one. If you're not, don't talk to me. So this is a trick. If you want to melt the cheese without using the, the pan or whatever, you're going to take some of the protein that you cooked up. It could be eggs or whatever. And you're going to put it on top. You see? It's nice and moist and nice and wet. It'll make all kinds of gains. We're going to put a little bit of onion. Usually we use this for the tacos, but I like putting it in the burrito. And then this little cilantro. You could call this a taco, huh? This is a taco? Dude, this is a taco, just a little bit bigger. We got add a little bit of arroz. I'm gonna put a little bit. I don't wanna put too much, to be honest. Just a little bit. Welcome to the trunk show. Make all kinds of games. You see? And then finally, just top it off, because I'm Mexican. For all my beans out there. Little tapatio. The guy with the sombrero or the Valentina. What's, what state is that? The third one for all my, my Asian folk. <laughs> for all my Asian folk. El gallito, el chicken, the ro the rooster. And just a little bit. We don't like too much, you know. I'm a... And now we gotta wrap it up. And this is the hardest part. This is the part where I find the most difficult. Wrap it up, guys. Wrap it up. Make sure you use safe, safe eating. Boom. And there we go. <laughs> hey, don't be judging me, bro. I don't care. Now we just eat it. Mmm. Mmm. Well, hold on. 20 out of 10. I'll see you guys on the third or fourth, fifth meal, alright? The, the guts are falling out, dude. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Bro, the guts. Fuck. 
All right, guys, we got meal three. Depends on how fast your metabolism is. Because I, I remember I posted this. Like I said, I posted my what I eat in a day on TikTok. And a lot of you guys are like, bro, if I ate what you ate, I'll gain like a pound every day. Like, bro, what the fuck? How, you guys are, I don't want to say that. <laughs> I was going to say, you guys are kind of fat. I eat this because it works for me. I don't know how fast your metabolism is. Dude, if I eat this, I feel a lot better. So it has a little bit of sugar. But anyways, it's a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Nice and thick banana right here. Let's peel the tip. Oh yeah, it's nice and thick. If you guys don't know how to prepare one, I'm gonna show you guys, cuz <laughs> shit, I don't know if you guys are kind of. <laughs> oh, dude, we're about to run right out. It's all good, we're gonna feed off this little bit. I forgot. You see, it doesn't matter how much peanut butter, just as long as you spread the whole thing on bread like that. Mm, nice. Spread it all over them cheeks. And if you got the Modella bug, make sure you don't lick the spoon because you might infect the whole family. If you know what that means, you know what it means. And look, shout out to my grandpa. This guy's a legend. <laughs> I was going to say something like, I came out of his nutsack, but that's my grandpa. My mom came out of his nutsack. <laughs> exactly. We're all legends here, you know what I'm saying? I'm glad he said that. He's probably like, bro, what are they, what are they filming? No, I'm glad he actually said something. Yes, sir. We have to get him more. You are his legacy. Lord <laughs> Trunks. If you guys haven't seen a wet white Mexican, you've seen him. He has green eyes, white skin. You're white. Nah, but I look like I'm Greek or something. People be telling me, bro, you're Mexican? I'm like, yeah, you can't tell? Nah, you have white skin. I'm like, what does that mean? Half of my fam has white skin. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Anyways, back to the shmamich. Yeah, the trend, trembolone peanut butter sandwich. It's pretty simple. I don't do too much of the peanut butter and jelly sandwich because this is already plenty enough. The only thing I add extra is the banana. If you guys don't like the banana, then use something else. I don't know, but this is fire to me. Mm -hmm. Nice and good right there. You see that's nice and thick? A little cheeks coming out. Yeah. Now we're gonna take a bite. Every time I eat this meal, my taste buds just go crazy. I'm probably gonna eat one more meal, but I don't know, it's kinda, it's kinda getting too late. If not, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, but most likely I'm gonna eat another one, just cause I'm hungry today. Make sure you eat the tremble on sandwich, the SARM sandwich. You guys are a bunch of puss boys. I put my SARMs in my sandwich and ingest the sandwich. I'm kidding, don't do that. Stay mad at you guys. There's no point of taking none of all that crap. Just work hard, be disciplined, most importantly, I'm a hard worker. You can keep on recording me or something?